What's up guys, it's Greg, and I'm back with another Awaken 180 food review. So, let's get right into it. Today we are doing the chocolate drink in a bottle. Uh, this is one of my go-tos. This is something that I have most days. I have been on the program uh, 30 weeks at this point, maybe even longer. So I have had easily 100 of these. Um, it's just what I go for. It's it's something that I I have enjoyed and it's uh it's good. It's easy to make and and it you know, you know it's just easy to grab and, and do it. So for this, I mean, there's not a whole lot for me to do to prepare it in order to show you. Uh, I did already put the water in. You just basically fill it up to this here line. I also put in a tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil. You know, let's go ahead and force those those uh, healthy fats. Um, so we just, we got to shake it up, got to shake it up. And then I will show you my little trick. There's all kinds of powder up here at the, at the bottom. Well, yeah, up here at the bottom, I know is a bizarre thing to say, but you know, you gotta, you gotta shake it up. And if you, if you do it like this, I find it's easier. You know, I, I oftentimes get a little ring up here. I just get a little, shake it like that in order to get everything um, incorporated and, and mixed up and so forth. And this is another one of those things that probably would be better if you were to make it up and then put it in the freezer for a few minutes just to really chill it out. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's good. Chocolate instant drink. Let's do it. Okay. Now again, I did put in the uh, the oil and that will be factored in to my to my review as as always so let's see okay it's a chocolate drink it tastes like um, it tastes like a, a chocolate milk or it tastes like um, you know if, if you had a milkshake that melted or, or if like, or if you had chocolate ice cream that melted and then you added water, because it's it's not as potent as uh, as like you know actual like chocolate soup, because you know it's it's not made with cream and, and so forth, but it's still pretty it's pretty good. I will say something that very much takes away from the experience if you add oil, it is not good at covering up the oil. I can really taste the olive oil in it. It it. Uh, You both, it, it's like it's just like you taste the the olive oil on top of the chocolate flavor when you when you do that. So definitely not something that I would recommend. I would say get your healthy fats in uh, elsewise in in other areas wherever wherever else you can put it in that it is completely masked. Uh, go go with that instead. Or you know obviously if you if you need to get it in you can you can do it in this, but you're going to taste it. It doesn't get covered up very well. It also, in addition to the taste, it changes the mouthfeel a little bit. It, it the mouthfeel might actually be improved a little bit because it, it has more of a creamy sensation because the oil is thicker than water and so forth. Um, but I, I still think I still think this is one that I would say avoid doing the uh, doing the oil in. This is, like I said, this is one of my go-tos, but that being said, I have to knock it down because of the oil factor. So I would say out of 10, I'm going to give this about a 7 out of 10. It's good, um, but I feel like one of the things that you really need to do is you need to push those healthy fats. and since this doesn't really incorporate it all that great it doesn't cover the the taste very well for me it's gotta it's gotta have a, a a penalty on that i think that by itself in a vacuum without any oil in it it would score higher uh but this is the real world folks there are no vacuums there are vacuums there are no vacuums when it comes to Reviewing the Awaken 180 foods, because that's how I roll. All right, guys, 
Thanks so much for watching. If you've been enjoying these videos, please consider subscribing, leaving a comment, and leaving a like. And uh, I'd like to hear from you. Have you tried the chocolate drink in a bottle? Have you had a different experience? You know, there's a bunch of different versions. There's the chocolate drink in the bottle. There's the chocolate shake slash pudding. There is the chocolate drink in a packet. How has your experience changed based on how you've tried it? I'm going to be reviewing those as well at a later date. But, you know, just kind of want to toss that out there. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching. And I will catch you all again soon. Bye.